Welcome back everybody. Today we're going to look at a game made by a bunch of my old friends. Uh, Disney Mirrorverse is a mobile game coming to you from the fine folks over at Kabam Games Inc. Uh, the studio is filled with amazing people that I have either worked with or taught. Uh, there's a lot of really talented minds over there building games like Marvel, Contest of Champions, and a whole bunch of other stuff that we have yet to see. Uh, I'm really curious to find out, what do you guys think of this game? Does it look too much like Contest? It definitely doesn't play like Contest. It looks pretty awesome to me. So let's just jump right over into the trailer and see what we can see. Legend speaks of a fateful steady collision. They always have top-end trailers and visuals. And Some amazing artists to work over there. Mirror. Boundless in power, disastrous in the wrong hands. Ooh, Scar. Fearless guardians protect this bridge to many worlds. That really takes me back to watching uh, the latest Who Thor, but I won't spoil that for anybody. Controls them all. I definitely dig it. It's got some, some Disney Infinity in it. It's got some Square Enix y, Kingdom Hearts y in it. Evolving them with extraordinary power. But, I mean, gameplay looks like it doesn't feel like either of those. It doesn't feel like Contest, and it definitely doesn't feel like uh, Kingdom Hearts. I've had a chance to play it a little bit, and it is a pretty fun little game. In these Where Contest was like a, you know, like almost like a 2D fighting game, relentless. this is more like a third person 3D action. Still team building though. <laughs> hey, it's my boy, get Baymax. I mean, I'm definitely getting some Kingdom Hearts vibes, but <laughs> the, the gameplay is different. And just like anything mobile, you know, it'll be free to play, I would imagine, with, you know, your microtransactions and things like that sort of tacked on top. All right, so what does everybody think? I think that looks pretty sick. I love that, uh, you know, they've given them artistic license and creative license. So thanks for coming along with me and taking a look at this, you know, twisted Disney tale. Everything is a little bit, a little bit different. And like I said, I, I just love it when they're willing to sort of take a chance and allow a developer to play with the licenses as opposed to playing too precious with, precious with it. Really hope that you find this video intriguing. And until next time, Baymax will be your personal healthcare companion. No, wait, <laughs> that's not it. Happy gaming, everybody. I'll talk to you soon.